What's up? I'm going to show you how to properly, at least best I can tell so far, best way to list your Top Shop moments for sale. So what I'm going to do, I've got this RJ Barrett here. Now you got to look at the serial number. My serial number is pretty low, 1662. It's not like it's jersey number or anything because you see it's 9. So none of that's involved in it, but we're going to see what other ones are for sale for right now. Lowest ask is 18, but it's way up here in the 82s. Let's look down here. Click that button there and see what they said sold for. That's the biggest sale, and that was on the 27th, so that was today. 100, uh, serial number 154. Went for 154 bucks. Okay. Looks like the other biggest sale that wasn't like one of those top 1,000 ones was 25 bucks for 3,000. I'm not seeing one really around my serial number. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go here. I'm going to look at other ones in my serial. I was 1662 or something like that. So I'm going to look at the ones in the thousands. Let's find the lowest one. 49 bucks. Depends on how much you want to sell it. 45 bucks, 49, 45. Okay, and that was all of them. Four, looks like 39 bucks is the lowest that I see. So if I really want to sell it, I could probably put it at 30, around here in this price range. I'll, if I want to sell it, I'll put it at 39. Maybe I'll put it at 45 bucks because I do want to sell it. Um, like this guy's not in a hurry to sell it. This guy's not in a hurry to sell it. I, uh, I think I'll probably list it around. I think I'll probably, you know what? I'm probably going to put it at 39 bucks. That's what I'm going to do. Because I do want to sell it. And we'll see what happens. You know, you adjust accordingly from there. And then place for sale. Couldn't process your sale. So I feel like something's wrong with the site. Feel like something's wrong with the site right now. Of course, something's wrong with the site when I'm trying to do this. Let's do this and refresh the page, see if we can get it up. I just got done opening a bunch of packs. I still got more to open, but I got this RJ Barrett out and I thought, you know, now's probably a good time. So there we go. Confirm. Now's probably a good time to make a video quick about how to go through and figure out how to um, put your moments up on the marketplace and how to like come up with what price you want to put them at. And it kind of depends on what you want, you know? What are you looking for? Are you, are you got this moment and you're like, you know, I'm not going to sell it for less than this because you just you really like it or something or do you just want to sell it and you know i could put it 18 bucks it'd be gone literally like that because of the serial number but i'm not going to do that i look at the ones around i'm not looking to give it away i want to be with my market and i think my market is in the thousands you know between 1000 and 2000 and if this is the lowest price in those that serial number and when people go through and look that's what they're going to look at and there weren't any listed less than that well it looks like i sold a moment i sold my Nikola Jokic for 14. See, I've sold. I've just been doing this for a little bit here, in the last 30 minutes. Maybe even put because I opened a bunch of packs. I'm putting a bunch of moments on the marketplace. I've sold three here already. Not not, not the biggest ones I put up, but pretty solid. And I'm happy with all of them. This one I just kind of undercut the market on because Stanley Johnson, whatever. Eight and this was about market. This was a little above market. They still took it. Let's go back to my collection. I'll find another one that I'll put up. Let's go to a cheap guy. I got a lot for sale. I ended up getting this Brawny. Whew. Wait, where, where'd Brawny go? There he is. I ended up getting that LeBron out of a pack. That was pretty great. John Wolf, Wall for sale. Let's go to Troy Brown Jr. Because he's not really anyone that special. Except for his mother thinks differently. So high, high number. Let's go to the listings. Click right here to go to it. Lowest one is three. And that is way better number than me. So it's probably going to be a lot of those. So I'll probably put mine at three. I don't want to undercut the market. Although maybe I should. I'm, maybe I should, maybe I shouldn't. I don't know. There weren't a whole lot of them at that lowest one, so maybe I'll just put it at three. I'm not in like a hurry to sell these. I just, like, they go so fast, seriously. Like, you don't have to worry about nickel and diming. Like, these these moments move pretty fast. And you can go in, you know, wait 24 hours, seriously, like 24 hours, because if it probably doesn't sell within 24 hours, you want to you wanna adjust something. Um, and I'll go back in here. And I will, I'll adjust accordingly. But right now I'm just putting it up. I'm not thinking too much about it. I go through that quick scan I showed you. Are you lagging site? What's going down? Are you going to put this thing up or what? There we go. I'll put another one up too because I'm just up here putting up a bunch of moments. Put that Troy TJ McConnell. Let's find a good one. No, this is a good one. Steph Curry. Now, I feel like his are, for some reason, undervalued compared to, like, LeBron and Luka. Oh, I got a Luka, too, and I already put that up on the market. Oh, shoot, what was my serial number? 
Seven thousand, decent. You know, seven thousand. Steph's what, what number is Steph? Thirty. That's right, thirty. So his if it was like seventy thirty, oh that'd be cool. Because people will like that that much more, but it's not. So no no really special number there. But so let's just go to the marketplace. So I got a better serial number than that. Let's check out the seven thousands. Actually, I, I'm in the low seven thousands. So mm, let's see here. Sixty. Sixty. I think if I really want to sell it, I can put it at sixty. Probably sixty-five. It'll go like that. Cause this guy's right by me, but I got a better serial number. Let's go up to see if anyone's beating that. Oh, oh there's a sixty right there, but there's only one, so I'm not. Uh, shit, and another one. I'm gonna scroll through this whole thing. I don't. I don't have to. So I'm getting into numbers now. There shouldn't be a 60 in here. 69. All right, let's go back up to to my numbers then, the 7,000s. What what number did I say I was gonna do? 65. Now mine's a little bit better, so maybe I'll do 68. So what did I see? I forgot. Oh, there's a 60 here though. I think I'm still going to do 68, though. That's what I think I'm going to do. I think I'm going to do 68. Whoops, not at the showcase. I think I'm going to do 68 and see what happens. Because, listen, I don't want to under... I, I think this I think this card is already... This moment is already underpriced compared to LeBron. Um, I mean, and Luka. Like, it doesn't make sense to me. But I'm going to get rid of it because what I want to do is I want to sell all these. And I want to get into... If I can put it all into, like, one really good moment that I can buy from the marketplace that'd be great I'd rather do that than have all of these that's me that's my personal preference you do what you want to do maybe you want to hold on to Steph you want to hold on to LeBron you want to hold on to Luca. I wouldn't hate you for that because you know we're all out here this is so new that we're just making our best guesses and that's my my preference that's all it is what's your preference whatever I don't know let's find another let's go to Chris Paul that's another one that should probably have a little worth to it a little High number eleven two three zero. What number is Chris Paul? Number three. Okay. Well, there's a three in it, but it doesn't really matter. Nine bucks. Mine's all high. Ugh. So, n anyone else? Ugh, no one else is even doing nine bucks. So I can probably do ten bucks and get away with it. Yeah, I'm put them up for ten bucks. For some reason my maps just popped up. Get out of here, maps. Just showed everybody I live in Seattle. Oh well. Put it up, put it up. Okay, anyways, well, I hope that helps you. Um, I again link in the description I have the sports card society where I spend I where I send an exclusive video almost every day to my sports card society members outlining a, a sports card investment that I think is a really good opportunity and I lay out all the research as to why in the video and members also get discount PSA grading they get 20 day PSA grading for just $25 if you go on the PSA website you'll see that 25 day grading is $50 so a big difference there and we have a private discord that we all chat in that's pretty great and uh, what else there was some, there's something else too really good about the society oh I'm going to be raising the price really soon it's only $9.99 right now but I'm going to be raising it really soon because it's just it's a lot of value for $9.99, and it's it's worth more. So I'm gonna be raising the price, and it's just I'm putting so much stuff into it that I, I'm just gonna have to raise the price very soon. But anyways, that's NBA Top Shot. That's how to list moments. At least that's how I do it currently. That's it's always a learning curve. It's all so new, but that's how I'm doing it. You do you, boo. <laughs> Stay classy. You're awesome.